Hi there. In this video, I'm going to show a brief overview on how to use a report in Adaptive Insights. So, as you can see, we're already on a report, but as a frame of reference to navigate to report, click this menu button on the top left, then click Reports, and then select the report you want to use. Now, here we are on the balance sheet report, and on the left, we could see the different accounts that are available. There's this expand or collapse button that allows you to see higher level or more granular detail. A nice feature about Adaptive is you have the ability to add notes into reports. So if I right click on cache, add line note, I can type in adding a note. And there's a note in the column all the way to the right. Let's say we wanted to move that to the bottom as a footnote. We could click in this notes drop down here, show as footnote, and that will get moved to the bottom. There's number one here as an indication, and if you click that, it'll populate the footnote on the bottom. So over here is a couple parameters on the top left that shows the period. Let's say we wanted to change this from April to July. When we do that, this run report button turns orange to let you know that the parameters have been updated and the report is still set to the prior parameters. So let's click run report and now we can see it's July to September. Now let's say we wanted to drill in and find out more about a given line. So this time we're going to left click and we could drill in Let's go to levels. So now we could see the different levels or departments that make up the different numbers. So we have all these different regions and we could again use the collapse or expand button to see the level of detail we would like to see. Now if we want to go back to the original view, there's this back button here, return to undrilled report. So there's a brief overview on how to use a report and to optimize the amount of functionality and figuring out the extra level of granularity behind the data. So hopefully this video helped. And if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thanks.